up you guys it's Jensen welcome back to my channel if you're new here make sure you go ahead and hit the subscribe button so you don't miss any of my videos and also go follow my social medias they will be somewhere on the screen so you guys can keep up with my life so a while back I want to say like a month ago I tried to film a video using some Pro Fusion palettes, and this was before I had my camera, and somehow I lost the footage, and so I'm here to do another video. Um, I just used this one in the other video, but then I got this, which is all um, metallic shades, and they look so fun, like, hello. So we're going to use this and the other one today. So, and we're just going to test them out. They are fantastic. Um, clearly, I already know, but whatever. So, I'm going to just go ahead and prime my eyes. I haven't primed my eyes in so long because of having eyelash extensions. I just, like, stopped because it was just easier not to because I couldn't get it all the way down to my lash line so it just looked weird and like you could tell where it stopped and started because half my eye had it on it and half didn't so all right so here are the eyes primed up I just used my MAC Painterly paint pot as always also sorry if you can see this huge monster on my face my acne I'm telling you has been terrible it's actually disgusting so I'm gonna go ahead and start off with the mirage palette this palette is so gorgeous like literally insane I'm gonna just go ahead and get started I'm gonna do something fun um because who cares um so yeah we're just gonna kind of go with the flow and see what happens to use this like hot pink glitter but like i'm like do i do i really we're just gonna put some stuff on our eyes and figure it out as we go so i'm just gonna go ahead and take this sonia kashuk brush this used to be my favorite brush of all times i still use it like all the time um it is so good it's the number 109 it's just like a blender brush i don't know and i'm just gonna take this cream shade it's in the color polite and it, these pal or these colors do have some pickup but like you'll see that how good the quality is and how cheap these palettes are it is 100% worth it. So this Mirage palette I think was $12.99. I'll have both of them linked below. Um, and then the Metallics one was um, $10.99. So the price varies um, just because this one only has 24 shades and this one has 35 shades. So it just kind of depends on what you get. Now, I'm going to take Dunn, or is it Dune or Dunn? I don't know. And then Outgoing, these two, and I'm just going to mix them. I use these colors literally almost every day. I love them. And I'm just going to put that in my crease. I'm going to have you guys right here um, so you can really see the eye look more um but these colors are so pretty so i think i am going to use that pink shimmer i've been like sitting here debating it um but yeah i think i'm gonna use it who cares basically what i'm gonna do is i'm just gonna do one eye on camera and then i'm gonna finish it and then do the other eye off camera just so that way the time passes quicker um so i've just been kind of going in with those same two shades and just 
working that in the crease to see like how much I want in there and I'm just building it up so I think this is kind of good right here so now I'm gonna take a different brush this is a Morphe M441 and I'm going to dip into Canyon which is a little bit well which is this color right here and it's a little bit more of a pink brown um, and I'm gonna mix that with the Marisol color because it's like a very pink so I'm gonna mix those two and I'm gonna pop that right on the outer edge and these colors literally just blend so perfect together I just can't so I'm going to leave that on the outer half and I am going to blend it in some but I'm going to be leaving like this part um, a little bit more of that brown shade. I'm going to go back in with the Sonia Kashuk brush that I had because I use one brush for multiple things and I'm gonna go into this dark chocolate brown down here and it is the shade compass I always take the little things that go on top so that way I still know what the colors are because like these and Morphe's oh my god that I didn't even realize they literally have the colors on the back now I feel dumb but I always just tape them on there because I like to know what the colors are and I have all my Morphe palettes like this so I'm just taking that dark brown and I'm just gonna put that in the outer V like this I think what I'm gonna do is take this hot pink right in the middle it's called Nimbus and I'm going to just use this oh, wrong brush. I'm just gonna use this brush right here this is a Morphe M124 and I'm gonna pick that color up and we're gonna lay this down before we lay that glitter down so it gives like extra hot pink vibes so I am just taking some Morphe spray and I'm going to spray my brush um, because I just like spraying the brush. I know some people like test it without, but I mean, I don't really care and I got my mirror dirty with the spray. Okay. So, oh, this is so pretty. These colors are so pretty. Like how I want it there we go Take a look at that okay now that we have that I'm gonna go into the glitter shade which is called OMG and I haven't used this yet. So I'm going to try it with a brush first and see how the product picks up on it. And then, if not, we'll use the finger. But, seems to have picked up a lot of product. Like, I'm trying to get to focus. Like, that is a lot. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and spray my brush again with this glitter. And we're just going to see... wow oh my gosh okay so I'm like feeling kind of weird because now that I'm looking at like the crease color and the pink it like doesn't really match that good but we're just playing I don't even care at this point I'm just going to be dipping into the the first color we took which was outgoing this like brown color and then the Marisol, is that how you say it, color and mixing those. And I'm just going to drag that along the lower lash. This is 
So if you can't tell, there is some fallout on my face, but like we just use a full on pressed glitter. So I imagined it to be that way. So I don't really care. Um, what I'm doing now, because I don't love how the crease looks with the glitter, I do now, but before I didn't, so I took that Marisol color that I dragged underneath the lash line, and I just brought it up all the way over into here because I wanted it to be a more pinky color instead of like an orangey color, so that's just what I did. You take the Metallics one, and I'm going to take Conquest, which is this like champagne color. And I actually swatched this last night, so I know that it's pretty. Spraying my brush again. And I'm just going to put that in the inner corner. Like that. So now really quickly, I'm going to go off camera and do the other side. And then I'll come back to finish up the look. Okay, so here is both eyes. I am I love their shadows. Like, they are so good. So, really quick, I'm going to pop on some mascara. I'm not going to do lashes because I do have to take this off to film another video. So, I'm just going to really quickly throw some mascara on. Okay, so here is the final look. I'm going to just pop on some lips real quick. And since we have such a bold eye look, I'm just going to do some new liner not a lot just a little this is mac in the color hover and then i'm just going to take my jeffree star gloss in the color legends only it's literally like a clear gloss and i'm just going to put that on top like I said, both of these products will be in the description, so you guys definitely need to check these freaking palettes out. It is literally insane how good these palettes are. Like, I want to buy every single one that they have ever created. Literally, each of them, one is $12 and one is $10. Like, you cannot go wrong with that. Um, I know that some Walmarts near me sell them and some Targets near me sell them. Um, not all of them do, um, so definitely check around and kind of see, but they are so good. This Metallics palette, I need to play around with a little more considering I only use two shades, but the two shades that I used were absolutely amazing. Um, they are a little bit chalky, like they pick up a lot of product on the brush. I don't know if it's because they're chalky or just because the pigment is really good. I have no idea, but I love these two so much. This one I would definitely pick up for the metallics just because you do have some mattes and some glitters and some shimmers and some pops of color. So you basically get everything in one right here. So that is all. I hope you guys enjoyed this. I absolutely love my eye look. Like I think it is so cute and I love the hot pink glitter. Like look at the, are you kidding? $12. I just can't get over it. So, if you guys enjoyed this video, make sure you like and subscribe and turn on my post notifications so you don't miss any, as my phone falls in the floor and breaks, so you guys don't miss any of my videos because I am trying to upload more. Um, I'm going to try to make it like two to three times a week. I've been slacking lately. Um because I've been really busy. I literally work 24-7, so I never have time to even edit a video to upload. But I just, like, record a bunch, and then eventually I get around to editing them. But I'm going to try to start uploading a ton more. So make sure you're subscribed and turn on the bell so that way when I do post, you don't miss any of them. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you in my next video. Peace.